Sasser in biofuel and clues. Project management, technology transfer and technical expertise to develop solutions to minimize and mitigate CO2 emissions through the diversion of the CO2 to open algal ponds and enclosed photo bioreactors. Algal propagation technologies to consume CO2 and waste streams. The company is presently consulting a listed company from Indonesia to address the technology know-how and implementation of microalgae development from the flue gas of the group's power plants. Utilization of power plant resources for growing selected microalgae strains at low energy cost for valuable products and biofuels while providing CO2 sequestration. Low cost algae agriculture, all year algae production, low cost flue gas providing CO2, low cost water source, residual energy, and better use of arid land. The production of non-oclerapsis with sequestration of CO2 from the existing Batam Indo investment Chakrawala powerhouse. Current usage of land is less than 50% of the total area. Target production capacity is 350 kg per day. Potential land capacity is up to 1.5 ton per day. These are the basic components of the area of the project. The laboratory, preparation area, CO2 and controller area, tanks and mechanical area, photo bioreactor, harvesting and biorefining. This is the future. Algae will be the answer to energy and will be the new food of the future. Tata Jabar is the leader in Indonesia in this field and will be the main global player in the algae industry. But you left me in